Uh, Luis, let me go back to you here. Keep it sort of in a USMNT type of flair. Uh, conversations with Fabrizio Romano. What more can you tell us about Gabriel Gagas Lunina, uh, a young kid born in 2004, and what's the latest on his front with Real Madrid now leading the way? Well, the journey is for this young man who is quite a remarkable goalkeeper, nearly 60% average uh, save stopping in MLS for Chicago Fire. I believe it's, uh, you know, four clean sheets already in his competition. And, you know, he's just another example of just a great farm academy that the U.S. has when it comes to goalkeepers and uh, with Ethan Horvath and Nottingham Forest uh, getting promotion to the Premier League, you know, this uh, name, this titillage of American goalkeepers is fantastic. Look, this kid is great. He's young and he's been wanted as per Fabrizio Romano, not just by Real Madrid. Chelsea wanted him, Bayern Munich wanted him, and now Real Madrid look to go for this great keeper. But I will want to put a little bit of an asterisk here because he's gonna be heading to Castilla. It's not like he's gonna take over Thibaut Courtois' number one role. And that worries me a little bit. The same with Stefan being a backup to Ederson at Man City. I think it's great for American goalkeepers to go to these huge teams. Of course, how can it not be great? And the academy and the training and everything that they will get under the Champions League winner, of course, is really a great advantage for this young keeper. But would it be more beneficial for him to go to a team that needs him right now in the starting 11? I don't know. I don't know the answer to that. I just know that it's great for this kid. Great to see him go to somewhere big like Real Madrid and Castilla. But I would like to see him tested a little bit more. Let's see how his trajectory goes. I mean, he's very young. All right. So obviously the good news is the fact that he's going to Real Madrid. Fantastic stuff. Yeah, nothing wrong with being 18 and the hottest young goalkeeper in the world, by the way. And we're talking about some big names, obviously. But there's been some other names earlier on, actually. Wolves and Southampton that showed interest as well. And if you look at those two teams, I feel he can compete for a starting position, obviously. There you can see him turn 18 in May, obviously. At 16, Tommy, he started in MLS. At 14, he signed his MLS homegrown uh, deal. <laughs> for him to get there and then he makes the choice between Poland and the United States. I want to play for the United States. He's been in two camps. I say right now, Gaga, you go to either Southampton or Wolves if that's on the table over a Chelsea or a Real Madrid where you're going to sit and you might play initially for the Castillas, correct? Do you want a sports network that delivers everything that matters about the game? The highlights, the picks, the instant analysis, no yelling, no fake debates, no politics. Hit the subscribe button and never miss a moment.